There is nothing that screams that you are going about something the wrong way, like when you keep getting failure while doing things the way you're doing it. When you keep going in circles, then you should know that another method is calling out to you. The problem is that most times you focus on things going wrong that you forget you are the reasons those things are going wrong in the first place. God places people at the strategic points in your life for a reason. God might have sent the person for you, but you prefer to keep them as friends, and then you go out there to exercise your choices, you get your heart broken, and then come back to this your friend to help you fix your heart. Of course they will because they love you and they don't mind because they always want you to be happy. Read the signs. That opposite sex friend that does everything for you without complaining might just be the one for you. The most thrilling thing is that in most cases they are even your soulmate, but you have friends and them that you can't even imagine yourself having a romantic relationship with them Yet, you are always looking for a partner that magically understands you. When you meet new people in your life, most times you find yourself looking at the exact same qualities as your friend, yet your friend is not a competitor for winning your heart. This circle is very common. You see two people of the opposite sex having a beautiful, non-romantic relationship, and they never even consider trying a romantic one. It's actually fine if they can have a romantic relationship outside of friendship, but if not, why not start a relationship with that your friend if you notice they are in love with you? If your mind is not open to this, you might end up losing your partner in the midst of you trying to avoid dating your friend. This might be the best thing to happen to you as there will be no need to start getting to know each other anymore. Both of you are already used to each other, you already know your likes and dislikes. You already have things you love doing together. So it would be easy to cope in such a relationship and it would be a happy one. When you keep going around in circles, in relationships and you keep using a particular friend that is in love with you for emotional support, it might just be a sign that you should be in a relationship with that particular friend instead. New people coming into your life cannot seem to meet up with a standard that you have set for yourself. There are just no exciting new people coming into your life anymore. It feels like you've reached the climax of meeting new people in your life, like you have known everyone you were supposed to know. Sometimes you even start digging old contacts out because you're not meeting new people in your life anymore. This usually occurs after you have a stable life already. You are done with school and you are not getting younger anymore. You already have a job and a place you are most likely planning to spend the rest of your life in. This means you would move around less and there would only be a few more people coming new into your life. This would ultimately give you an idea that you have already met your partner already. The common mistake people make is that they do not realize this in time, so they start forcing themselves to go to places they have no business being in, and they end up forcing themselves to meet people they should not be with, and at the end of the day, these relationships sum up to be the worst relationship stories they would ever tell. When you begin to feel irritated by people around you, don't force it. In everyone's life, there are positions to be filled. You have friends, you have colleagues, you may have a best friend, you may have a mentor and more. The thing is, for everyone you meet, they have a role they want you to play in their life. Though these things are not spoken, but by their attitude you should know. You might meet a new friend that loves seeing movies just like you do. They only ever talk to you when they want to talk to you about a movie or when they need movie recommendation. These things happen everywhere. There are positions to be filled in people's lives. The thing is, there comes a time when you do not feel like you need anyone in your life anymore. It feels like all the spots in your life is already taken. When you meet new people, you have no idea where to place them. You just know you're complete. 
The crazy thing most times is that you realize you actually do not have a partner yet, but even at that, you do not feel like you need one. This is usually because there is already someone filling that spot in your life. There is already someone you talk to about your everyday life. There is already someone that listens to everything you have to say. There is already someone you go to for the emotional support you need. The only need is that the two of you might not have to spell it out to each other to go into a relationship. This is almost always the case. When it feels like your circle is filled, it's usually a sign that you already met the person you were meant to be in a relationship with. All you need to do is figure out that one person, that is acting the possession of your partner. Most times you are usually scared that what if this person is not in love with you, but truth be told, for someone to make all these sacrifices for you, there is every possibility that the person is in love with you. They probably have been showing you signs. Getting a partner this way would also be exciting because the two of you do not need to start from scratch anymore. You already are used to each other. The mistake you make most times is that when you have someone, you are used to giving the exact vibe you need from someone you want to spend the rest of your life with, you tend to ignore it. You may be feeling that you do not want to mess up a beautiful friendship, but even at that, you should also know that you are giving up the chance to have a beautiful relationship. When your heart sees what it wants, pray about it to make sure that you are making the right choice, then go for it. Sometimes missing this opportunity may set you up in a relationship that you would later regret in life. Take the fact that you already know this person away from your mind and let things flow the way it's supposed to. Sometimes you may be lucky that the exact kind of relationship you've been looking for is found in someone you've known for a long time. This has a lot of advantages. There will be no issue of acceptance because this person is already in your life and knows almost everyone in your life, including your family and friends. So your family and friends accepting this person would not be a problem. When someone you know already feels like the perfect person for you, do not let the fact that you know the person affect a beautiful relationship that is meant to happen between you too, because this might just be you blocking God's will for you. Sometimes, even without meeting your future partner, you already have your life planned out. When this happens, there is always a huge chance that the person you will end up with is someone you already know. The most important thing to note is that you should not push things too hard and let things happen naturally. For you to already have your life planned out, this means there is some confidence in you that the person you would spend the rest of your life with is around the corner. When you see this, it's definitely a sign that you already met the person you would spend the rest of your life with.